Hi, I'm Sim from Heirloom Naturally. We grow old fashioned vegetables and seeds in the field without chemicals in the wonderful high country town of Mansfield, Victoria. And I just wanted to talk to you briefly about the best way to store your seeds. Uh, often people will say there's just too many seeds in a packet for me to use in any one season. So what's the best way for me to keep them? And certainly what we would say is that it's always best to try to use the seeds in your packet in the same year that you've purchased them. Really just like vegetables, they're at the freshest at the time that you buy them. And so the sooner you can use them, um, the more viability you'll get out of your seeds. But I completely understand that often uh, we're more generous um, than, than you can be in your own garden with the number of seeds in each packet. Uh, so in my opinion, and certainly how we do things here at Heirloom Naturally, it's best to store your seeds in an airtight container in the fridge. And the reason for that is that there are two main things that greatly decrease the germination rate of your seeds. The first is fluctuation in temperature. Uh, so if we're tempted to put them into a shed uh, or an outbuilding of some sort, uh, which I can completely understand, I've done that in the past myself, uh, it can go from extremes in terms of temperatures within that building from the high heats, uh, so you know, think about a 35 degree day inside that shed, uh, it's probably going to be closer to 40, 50 degrees Celsius inside that shed. Uh, right through to the middle of winter when it's freezing cold, it's going to be pretty chilly. And so when your seeds are exposed to extremes of temperatures, that will greatly uh, degrade them and of course decrease their germination rate. The second thing and the reason why we suggest to keep them in an airtight container in the fridge is moisture. And so if you think about a seed, what they need in order to start their germination process is water. And so if we simply leave them outside in their packets and they're not in a little Ziploc, uh, Ziploc bag or, or anything like that within um, their packets, they will be exposed to moisture, which might mean that they start their germination process and then obviously if they're not continually exposed to moisture and the correct growing conditions, um, then they'll just die. So we don't want our seeds exposed to moisture unless we're ready to start germinating them. Hence why a sealed container within the fridge is the best way to do it. Now for a little bit of extra guarantee with uh, not having moisture in that container, what you can do is to get some of this silica gel. Uh, now these come in all kinds of things now if you buy a new... Um, a new pair of shoes, um, even if you're buying wraps, uh, generally something like this will come within that packet. Save all of these, um, they're fantastic little things and what they do is that they take the moisture out of their external environment. So that's really the easiest way to do it. Sealed container in the fridge, you keep out the moisture, you keep the temperature constant and your seeds will be happy for at least the next two, three, four, five, maybe even 10 plus years, depending on what the seed variety is. So I hope you're enjoying growing your own and eat well, stay well.